Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to multitask on your iPod Touch or iPhone. You do have to be jailbroken for this. So we're going to be using a thing in Cydia called MultiFlow. You might have heard of it, you might have not, but um, it's pretty much multitasking. So um, before I show you guys how to actually um, get this onto your iPod Touch or iPhone, I'll be showing you guys um, how it works first. Alright, so the first thing, you get um, two icons, and I don't know if you guys can see them very good right there. But it's called Backgrounder and multi -pre multi flow prefs. So yeah, um, you don't really have to change anything when you install those. But what you do is you double tap, and you get all the w windows or um, the other things that you opened. And yeah, so um, if you go into multi prefs, you get to show like um, instead of double tapping the home button you can change that to um, single tap the home button press and hold the home button press and hold the the power button anyways that's pretty much it it's pretty easy to get the hang of it um, but yeah I'll just show you guys a little bit of how it works okay you guys so let's say I want to go into the app store um, you just hold it the home button it'll say background disabled that means it won't save so press it again and it is enabled so if I exit it, then I will go to double tap and it will be right there. As you guys see the app store, and I'll just have to click and type in again. So I want to exit, go into Safari, double tap, and go back to the app store. So that's pretty much how it works. Now I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually get this um, tweak on your iPod Touch. Anyway, so first thing you want to do is open up Cydia. And uh, you are going to have to add a source, but I'll tell you guys that after it's downloading and I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, so after um, City is done loading, you can go into Sources, because we're going to have to add a source. So go into Sources, you want to go down over here to Edit, and Add. And the source you're going to add, what you're going to want to add is repo.beyouriphone.com. Repo.beyouriphone.com. Okay, you guys, so after you're done um, adding that source, it should look like this, like the top one. Alright, so after that, go into search, and you want to search in, just type in multi, and it should show up right here, multi flow, and um, the zero, the O is a zero, so you can't really type it in, or you can, but just remember that. Alright, so um, you can type that in if you want. Alright, so um, there is a paid version. This is actually paid, but um, if you type in the so if you type in the source, sorry about that. If you type in the source, and you will be able to get it for free. Alright, so you just tap it, and um, on the, uh, on the right top right there, you should be able to have install and confirm that. Alright, um, so yeah, after that, it should respring your iPod Touch or iPhone. And yeah, you should pretty much be done. And um, I already showed you guys how to use it. You just double tap in this default settings and you just go around and do whatever you want. Alright, so uh, also all these steps will be in the description um, on the bottom of this video. And uh, so everything will be in the description on the bottom. And don't forget to subscribe and uh, thumbs up this video if you like it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.